coach in Ohio State men's basketball history, Ben Mata. Shirley coaches his wife, Barb, and their daughters, Allie and Emily. Coach Mata, a three-time Big Ten Coach of the Year, led Ohio State to nine Big Ten titles. Five regular season and four big tournament crowns. His teams made nine appearances in the NCAA tournament, advanced to five Sweet 16s, two Final Fours, and played for a national title in 2007. Eleven of his players were NBA draft selections, including eight first rounders. He also coached eight All American selections and one National Player of the Year. His 337 wins are the most in the 120-year history of the program. Now fans, please direct your attention to the Raptors near Section 309 in the southwest corner of the arena and help us recognize Bad Mata's accomplishments with a banner that will forever hang in his honor here at Value City Arena. for us to come back. To David Engelhoff, who is, is probably, he was with me every step of the way from the first day to the last day, probably the most loyal human being that I know, and I know he was behind a lot of this. Um, you know, just some, some special people getting here and, and I tried not to show up but I was scared to death and there were three people, a man named Jack Schramm, a man named Jim Trussell and a man named Jim Foster who did an incredible job of, of helping me navigate through that. I think also, you know, I, I've developed some great friends and, and I gotta say thank you to a guy, Joey Schottstein and his two crew for loving me for who I was, not for wins and losses, and, and always putting a smile on my face when I needed it. Because you don't get friends like that in coaching very often. Also, I want to thank the doctors who, who took care of me. And starting with Vince O'Brien, our trainer, I've always said this, Vince, Vince could write a book. Because late on in my career, I was spending more time in the training room than well, I won't name the player, but you all know who I'm talking about. <laughs> also, you know, from, from Grant Jones to Jim Borchers to Don LeMay to Dr. Andy Thomas to, to Nino Kioka to Steve Smith, uh, Udi Mandel, all these guys, Roto Knudsen, were one call away whenever I needed them. Chris Cady, who was my neighbor, I can't explain how many nights uh, I pulled in his driveway and he helped me get out of the car. Um, finally, I want to thank the coaches that I worked with. I didn't have great coaches or good coaches. I had great coaches. And those guys did a phenomenal job of, of carrying the load for me. And to the players that I coached here, honestly, there's no words that, that I can put in to them. You know, Barbara and I gave every player that played for us a cross after their time because we wanted to know that we were with them and God was with them as they went into the real world. It's my only 
really hope that every time one of my former players comes in here and they look up there, they smile. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Fred Amato!